Hi guys, welcome to Test Driller Virtual Class Biology. This promises to be exciting as I walk you through the entire syllabus. Biology syllabus is subdivided into three sections. Section A, Section B, and Section C. Section A is for all candidates. Section B is for candidates in Ghana only. Section C is for candidates in Nigeria Sierra Leone, Gambia, and Liberia. Section B, you will be tested on short structured question. Section C, you will also be tested on short structured question. Please take note that section B and section C are all the type of questions that are called short structured question. Let me walk you through this syllabus quickly. So, section A. Section A includes topics like classification, organization of life, forms in which living cell exists, cell structure and function, cell and its environment, properties and function of living cell, excretory system, nervous coordination, hormonal coordination, sense organ, reproduction in both plants and animal. Also in section B, a, you have plant and animal nutrition. In section A, you have basic ecological concepts. In section A, you have conservation of natural resources. In section A, we also have adaptation for survival and evolution. In section A, we have variation and heredity. That's genetics. Remember I said, all these are for candidates in all countries for all candidates now let's move to section b of the syllabus section b of the syllabus must only be for candidates in ghana topics like introducing biology topics like cell biology topics like living processes in biology protein synthesis cell structure cell cycle ectocytosis endocytosis these questions will be tested in section b also in section b we have diversities of living things interaction in nature mammalian anatomy and physiology plant structure and physiology reproduction will be tested in section b cellular respiration movement muscle and skeletal tissue will be tested in section b Still in section B, we have biology and industry. Biology and industry, you will have topics like biotechnology. Recombinant DNA technology will be tested in section B. Please take note, this section are only for candidates in Ghana. Now let's move to the most important section in section C. For candidates in Nigeria, Sierra Leone, Gambia, and Liberia. Remember, I said this section is for only candidates in Nigeria, Sierra Leone, Gambia, and Liberia. So it's a very important section for these candidates in this mentioned country. Topics like concepts of living organism, plant and animal nutrition nitrogen cycle mode of nutrition alimentary system feeding habits basic ecological concepts basic ecological concepts and population studies will be tested in section c also in section c application of variation such as crime detection blood transfusion determination of paternity evolution also under that, we are going to be tested on adaptation for survival, adaptation for structural survival, adaptation for adaptive coloration. Then we look at most frequently occurring topics in their descending order. Supposing you don't have enough time and you must read and study but pass this exam, what do you do? We are going to look at this chart. This is the most frequently occurring topics that are set 
every year in biology. Number one, plant and animal nutrition. Both plant and animal nutrition sits the top of the percentage of questions set every year. About 56% over the years have been set in plant nutrition. Then 54% questions are drawn from animal nutrition. 37% are drawn from transport system. Respiratory system sits at 34%. Then tissue and supporting system sits at 33%. Then basic ecological concept ecosystem sits at 31%. And then you have genetics sitting at 24%. And you have evolution, structural adaptation at 22.9%. Then, top on the list I've told you is plant nutrition. Then, bottom on the list is bottom on the list. Is, then, bottom on the list is concept of living organism, such as sense organ, structure, and function. Please, I want us to make sense of what I have said. Please note that biology syllables are drawn into three parts and divided into three papers paper one is for objective question and that takes total of 50 questions and these questions are drawn from section a of the syllabus paper two is essay question those are drawn from both section a section b and section c section a is for objective Session B and C are for theory. The theory part must be peculiar to your country. Candidates in Ghana must take Section B and candidates in Nigeria, Sierra Leone, Gambia and Liberia will take Section C. Take note that each question in Section A carries 20 marks while the compulsory short structured question Section B and C carries 30 marks plus the OBJ question that gives us a total of 70 marks for practical papers take note that section A you will have two compulsory questions from section A and section B you have one question for section B only for candidates in Ghana and for section C of the practical question you will have one question drawn from section C and that will carry 30 marks and it's for candidates in Nigeria, Syria alone, Gambia and Liberia. Candidates will be expected to answer all the questions in A and one question in either section B or section C. Your practical questions takes 80 marks while your objective question takes 50 marks and your essay question takes 20, 20, 20, 30, which is 70. Now, please note that your total time you are supposed to spend in your theory question is 1 hour 40 minutes. Please take note, all this information are very important if you must have a smooth sailing in your exam. Thank you for watching and see you some other time. I hope this has been informative for you and I want you to take note of all the information that is given in the first virtual class. Thank you for watching and stay around for more information in virtual class biology.